Welcome to the Enrollment Reporting Error Resolution Series. Today we'll learn how to resolve anticipated graduation date and anticipated completion date related errors. Anticipated graduation date is the date at which you anticipate the student to graduate from their program. It's important to notice that anticipated graduation date, or AGD, is considered the same as anticipated completion date, or ACD. From the Student Reporting tab on the Clearinghouse Secure site, select the Error Correction link. This takes us to the Error Correction page. Here you may see an error number 6, which occurs when the school fails to provide the AGD on the enrollment file for enrollment status of F, Q, H, L, or A. This error must be corrected in order for the school's enrollment file to be submitted to NSLDS. For the purposes of this tutorial, though, we will be editing error number 73, which can be resolved in a similar way. Click the link for error 73. This takes us to the Error Details screen. Here you can edit individual student records with error 73, or you can update all records containing this error. To correct individual records, simply update the anticipated graduation date fields in two-digit month, two-digit day, and four-digit year format. Don't forget to check the box to the right in order to update any corrected records in the Clearinghouse system. For students who do not have an AGD or ACD, like non-degree seeking students, a best practice is to use the term end date for AGD. Once done, click the Submit Selected Records for Validation button. You can also view details in the individual student records by clicking the blue plus sign located on the left. You can update any part of the individual student record in the Details screen that appears in white. Updating on this screen can help prevent any additional errors for this particular student. The Clearinghouse strongly recommends that you review details prior to submitting correction. Be sure to click the Submit for Validation button to save your changes. From the same page, to update all records with Error 73, just click the Update All Records for Error link. This will take you to the Mass Corrections page. Simply click the Select Error box. Enter in the anticipated graduation date, and click Submit. For more detailed information, please review the Enrollment Reporting Programming and Testing Guide or view our other online tutorials.